welcome back. I don't remember how the rest of that goes. Anyways, welcome back. Thanks for coming to the show today. Super happy you're here. I got this really cute project I wanna do. So the other day I was at a garage sale and I found these like kind of glass crystal-ish candle holders and they're really pretty and I wanna do something with them. So let's do it. Are you ready? I'm ready. Here we go. Okay guys, first of all, let me just say, I apologize because I'm not really feeling so hot, so my throat hurts and I'm a little stuffed up, but I really want to do this project, so we're going to do it anyways. So the first thing is, you get these candlesticks. Now I just found these at a garage sale the other day, but dude, they're so freaking cute and I love them. And they're going to match my lamps downstairs. So I have that one and then this other one, it's just a little bit shorter, but it's the same style. So, of course, I need to bling out the bottom and the top here, and this little part here. So I have some of this ribbon. Well, it's not ribbon, it's, um, what do you call it? It's just, you know, adhesive bling that came in a sheet. So anyways, and you don't have to do this, but you know how I am. Okay, so I have a strip cut out that's gonna fit that uh, bottom part here. So I'm gonna flip it over. I don't know if you guys can see this, but I'm just going to carefully attach it to the bottom. Oh shit, that wasn't careful. Okay, so I went ahead and did the base. And now I'm going to do this middle part and this part up here. And now we'll do this top part here. Good enough. Okay. So that part is done. And we also have this one. Okay. Okay, so now you're going to take the glass dish that you have. The sticker is still on there. I don't really care. It's going to get covered up anyway. And then you're going to take your candlestick, whoops, and you're gonna see where you want it, okay, right about there, that looks good. Then here you're gonna go with your, I'm gonna use Gorilla Glue, but you can use E6000. I, I don't think that I would mess with a glue gun. Okay, so I'm gonna give a nice generous amount on the, on the bottom of the bowl itself. All right, so that's that. Now, I'm gonna set this aside. I'm gonna do the same thing on this one. You guys, for your animal fact today, we're gonna to talk about gorillas. It's a good one. Okay, so they can be about six feet tall. They weigh in around 550 pounds, like on average, and they are really smart. They can learn sign language. They can make their own tools, okay? You know what else they can do? This is so freaking weird. So if they want, they can turn their body odor on and off. 
So like if they don't want a predator, I, I don't know who the predator would be in this situation, but if they don't want somebody to know they're around, they can turn it off. But if they want the ladies to smell them, they'll turn it right back on. Crazy. Okay, here's for the big part. They can smash your freaking skull with one punch. They have a 1,300 to 2,700 pound um, force behind one punch. I don't know how you word that. That's how I'm wording it. So that's freaking crazy. Also, they have a bite that is twice that of a lion. A freaking lion. I would not fuck with a gorilla. They'll rip your face off. Okay, so this is basically ready to go. I'm sure it's not completely dry, but it's good enough. So now you wanna take, and you can do however you want, but I have these, I think they're really pretty and they match my decor. These green, like teal green marbles. So I wanna put some of these in here and I'm gonna be very careful. So that's glass on glass. So there's that and then I also have this base filler okay so I'm gonna sprinkle some of that in there okay. and then you can leave it like that okay so I have these they're like little foil flakes I think and I'm I'm just gonna Sprinkle them in there. Well, it's in there, but you can't really see it. All right, so last, I have these little I don't really know what you call them, but they're like tiny, tiny, tiny little crystal gems. So I'm just gonna go ahead and sprinkle some of these in. I'm trying to get it to go like around the edge. Anyway, that's it. I'm gonna call it. All right, so I'm gonna finish up this one, but I wanna tell you thank you for coming to the show. As always, you know I really appreciate it and I really like this project. I think it turned out super cute and I hope that you guys had fun too. And we will see you on the next one.